Hello everybody, my name is Broken Chico, and this is the second time I've tried to do my introduction because I was interrupted by a Facebook message the last time. So it might sound a little scripted, but I'm going to get right into the video since I've already talked a lot about just random stuff that I wasn't happy with. And uh, we're going to kill these sentry bots. You basically get to kill them for free, you just spray them with your little paint gun, paintinator, and it'll basically blind them and they run around and they die. It's kind of sad, but it's how it works. Anyway. What I wanted to talk about in this episode was basically the future of the channel and how it's going to go. Because really, I've been thinking a lot about it. I wanted to change some things, but I also wanted to add some things instead of just removing. And I came to a pretty good conclusion with it. First off, I am going to continue doing World of Warcraft videos. That's not going to change. It's a really easy series to do. I can pretty much record it uh, without having to feel bad about doing certain things differently or not editing a super large amount of the clips into it. I can just kind of record straight through, upload the finished product with a little bit of editing and color correction and move on and keep making videos like that. So that's a really easy and pretty relaxing way to make my videos because I also get to talk and I get to just say what's on my mind at whatever given moment I'm playing at. And that's what I like doing, so I'm going to stick with this definitely because World of Warcraft is a great game and I like using it for content really that's pretty much what I get to do is I get to make a lot of content with it and I don't have to feel like I'm not uploading enough or I'm uploading too much because really it's one of those totally optional things to watch <laughs> now there is a little bit of a cinematic here but I think I'm gonna leave it in because it's kinda story based but I'm gonna talk over it so I apologize if you wanna see it but if you do you can just make a gnome it takes like five minutes to get to level six, maybe a little more than that, but uh, you can get there pretty easily. Anyway, the other thing I wanted to do was starting uploading some other things. Uh, Rius, or Reuse, or however you say it, it's a game with four giants that you make civilizations with by raising mountains, creating oceans, and all that. Uh, if you haven't heard of it, it's on Steam. Just Google it. R-E-U-S and it's a pretty fun game. I've been playing it for about two hours already and I think I should start making videos on it because it's really entertaining. And the matches are really short. You do like predefined matches like half an hour and you try to get as far as you can in a half hour and such like that so I can pretty much record for a set time and I'll know how long the thing is going to be. So I really want to get that uh, up and going because it's a really easy series as well. It's nothing uh, overly complicated and it doesn't require that much time so I won't have to be like uh, stressing myself out with deadlines and such. Also, I was talking with a fellow YouTuber and Steam user, uh, Billy14842 I believe. I don't remember his YouTube name but his name on Steam is Ironically King. So I like uh, his Steam name a lot. Anyway, I was talking with him and we were talking about different ways to grow your YouTube channel and how we do it and uh, what he's using and what I'm using and we ended up deciding that we should film something together and we ended up going with uh, Killing Floor, sorry I forgot the name of it I was thinking of Path of Exile for some reason but that's with Steven, that's what I've got planned with Steven uh, but we're gonna upload Killing Floor and we're not quite sure how we're gonna do it we were discussing some different ways that we could do it one of them was we'd record each map just kind of give it one attempt and upload the map however it goes uh, another possible way was we just like make kind of like a montage or not a montage but just edit in all the best moments and see how it goes so I'm not too sure how that's gonna go but Killing Floor uh, is definitely a thing good to go because whether I record with him uh, that'd be really cool because it sounds like a lot of fun but even if something comes up and we can't do it I'll still upload the game by myself Although I won't probably do it nearly as much, because doing it alone would not be very entertaining, nor would having multiple episodes really be beneficial. It'd pretty much be the same thing over and over. Although that is kind of wow, in a nutshell. But I think it'll be interesting to see how that goes. And the last thing I have planned is a Surgeon Simulator kind of uh, upload. I don't know how I'm going to do that either. Nobody really knows. I don't know what I'm really doing at all, to be honest. Uh, this whole thing's kind of a formality. I could just say I'm going to upload these three games. But the main thing I want to do is kind of get some ideas from you guys. If anyone has a suggestion, uh, you can, of course, leave it in the comments below. But I'm also probably 
going to have to figure this out by myself. I think it's just going to have to be how it goes because certain things in life and certain events change your possible paths, I guess you could say. Uh, by doing one thing, you kind of... It sounds a little depressing, but by doing one thing, you kind of block out other things. But at the same time, you open the potential to do more things. So, the farther you get in life, the more, I guess, narrow your path becomes, but it also becomes longer. I'm going to say that. I don't even know if that quote makes sense, but I just made it up right now. I'm pretty proud of it. Oh, I know why I left this water on my desk now. Uh, I had this water on my desk, and I thought, hey, this is really good because my throat's starting to get sore. I haven't talked in a while. And I went to drink it, and I remembered why I left it on my desk and didn't put it back in the fridge. It's like this calcium water, and it's for breast cancer, so I think it's like boob water or something. It's uh, It tastes like a little bit of milk mixed in with water. It's absolutely disgusting. I don't know why I drank that, but uh, it's at least it helped my throat, I guess. I don't know if helped is a good word, because now it's like contracting into like a disgusted throat. Alright, that wasn't fun. Okay, I decided just to edit out that little bit of walking. I also got a Skype call, so I thought it'd be uh, perfect just to take that whole portion out. Anyway, on to uh, what I was talking about before, about the direction of the YouTube channel. I have something else to talk about, and that's my production value videos. Uh, I know I've recently said in like the past three series I've mentioned that I like them because they're really easy to do. I don't have to stress about deadlines. And the reason that I haven't revealed any of my production value things before is because I really do get stressed with deadlines. I don't like them. And I feel like if I have a deadline, I might take something that could be a lot better and rush it. So I am going to talk about these things, but they are tentative as for release dates. Not quite sure yet. Uh, same with pretty much all my videos. They're all kind of tentative because I don't know when I'm going to upload them. Or when they'll be done. I upload them when I'm happy with them, is kind of how I do it. Anyway, uh, one thing I wanted to do was a WoW Machinima. I'm currently writing it right now. I don't know if I've mentioned before, but I do really like writing. Something I do enjoy doing. I have a feather pen, which is awesome to write with, by the way. If you've never used one before, you really should. Uh, it's pretty much, like, it feels scratchier. It's definitely not as comfortable, but it looks so nice when you write it on the paper. It's, it's just awesome. And I'm also hoping to get like a, a leather notebook just because I like writing and that would really set the mood for some writing stuff. Anyway, I wrote out the machinima. I've also done a drama class for screenwriting so that's good too. And I hope to get it uploaded but I need some people to act it out. Now I'm not asking for volunteers uh, although that would be nice. I don't, I'm not expecting anyone to be like ready to go. But I am working on getting some people together, some friends of mine and some friends of other friends that I don't really know, but that are apparently really good voice actors. So I'll throw that together when it's done. Actually, I'll do more than throw it together. I'll stress over it and get uploaders anxiety, but you know, basic things. And that's something that I'm looking forward to because it's a concept that me and Steven came up with together while we were leveling our first characters through World of Warcraft. We were talking about uh, how ridiculous Pandaria is and how much like just absolute death goes on there for no reason and uh, we made it into a kind of a machinima a kind of a moral of the story machinima but uh, still on the more comedic side because it is World of Warcraft I mean how serious can you get anyway uh, that's something that we're working on so it should be done whenever it's done I, I was gonna give you guys like a tentative date but that would just stress me out so I decided not to uh, and another thing I wanted to do was to get together some League of Legends footage and make kind of a more production value montage or not a montage but just a best moments kind of thing record for a couple hours and take the best moments and put them together into a 15 minute video so only the best like top top 10 percent of the footage would get in is basically what I was trying to get at because that's that makes it a lot more entertaining I think in my opinion so, that's my current plans right now. There isn't much else on the table going on, I don't think. Not too much in my mind. So, as soon as I'm finished with these tender boar ribs, I will wrap this video up. First, I gotta find some boars, though. That's a little more difficult. 
They all just disappeared. I'm sorry if you can hear my family in the background. They're looking at a rainbow, and apparently it's very interesting. Because they're all making really loud, like, ooh, noises at it. And it's just, it's kind of, kind of disturbing, actually. I can hear it from here with my door closed. And on the other side of the house. Never expected that. Anyway. I did find some boars, as you might notice in the video footage. You can tell I'm stalling for time right now, because I don't have anything to talk about. I ended a little early. It's kind of something I need to work on, is ending my videos at better times. What I always do is I think, like, oh, I'll end it after this quest, but I think that as soon as I'm run out of things to talk about, and then it's like, oh, well, now i got to make something up while I do this, and it shouldn't be too hard, but it is. It's a lot harder when you actually get to it. That's also why having two people is great, because you can keep a conversation instead of talking to yourself and expecting an answer. Anyway, I'm going to wrap this up now that I'm done the quests. I'll skip over to the next like quest hub when I start the next video so you won't see me doing all the turn-ins and junk. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you liked it, I'd appreciate a like, as a comment, and possibly a subscription. And if you didn't, please let me know why, so I can improve and post better stuff. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Later.